on this Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom, you're going to pick up the, the best piece of storytelling advice that I've heard in months, if not the last couple of years, and it will help you become a better storyteller. A couple of weeks ago at Toastmasters International Conference, I heard an insight into storytelling that was refreshing and new for me, and it will help you become a better storyteller. Here it is. It's from speaker Kate Lutz. She says, far too many people spend way too much time on the people in place in their stories, and they don't get to the conflict, the action, and the resolution fast enough. That's where the story grabs people's attention, keeps their interest, and holds them all the way to the end. If you think about it, most of the stories that you've heard and maybe the ones you've created, I know I've been guilty of this, way too much backstory on the people involved, the hero, the guru, the ancillary characters, and also the setup. We gotta cut that down. A great example that I saw in the, in the World Championship of Public Speaking, actually Aaron Beverly, the world champion, took about 25 to 30 seconds to set up the story and the rest of it involved the conflict, the action, and the resolution. Because of this insight that I've gotten from Kate Lutz, I've created a couple of acronyms. Don't spend too much time on the PP, the people and places, spend more time on the car, the conflict, the action, the resolution. You can do whatever you want with those acronyms, but it will help me remember that as I am putting my own stories together, and more importantly, when I'm coaching others. Think about the best books you've read, the best movies you've watched, the best stories and speeches you've heard. Didn't they immediately pull you into a conflict? Didn't they escalate that conflict? And eventually, didn't they resolve it and then show the hero or the main character's life after going through all those trials and tribulations and winning the day? Try this with your next story. I think you'll find that your audience will react much better to you and you'll leave a lasting impact. Talk with you on our next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom.